There's a typo in the book. Unless Office 2019 handles this better, but usually 365 handles things just as well. So we are creating this higher year column, referencing the year from the higher date. So we structure a reference. Of course, every formula begins with equals. Type in year. Open our parentheses. And it suggests we open a bracket. And we have the higher date right here. And I can close the bracket, followed by the parentheses. And it references this. You can see the highlight. We check to OK. Uh, however, it returns multiple values not supported in tables. And it wants us to add the little at sign. Thankfully, it knows exactly what we want. Weirdly, it doesn't just do it. But we click yes. And there we have it. And notice the change up here. We've got the at sign in there. Interesting. Notice looking down this row here that it is not formatted correctly. And this is interesting because it's pulling in the date formatting from the previous year. However, the actual information itself is just the year. Press control and spacebar to select the entire column. Change the formatting from date to general. And there we have it. Just a simple, easy number.